Hello, welcome to the vlog. It's 6.20 and I'm leaving my house. I'm actually running up the street to the gas station because Connor tried this new like energy, well I guess it's not new, but it's new to him, um, energy drink called Rain and he thought that I might like to try it for work instead of Monster. And I do have a Monster left uh, that I brought with me, but it's my last one, and I'm starting a stretch of three nights, so I'm gonna need two more. So I figured I'd just run up to the gas station right now and see if they have them or not, and I might just grab one. I don't think I'll grab like three. I think I'll just grab one and see how I like it tonight and go from there, but hello, I did my hair. Feeling a little cute. Um, I have like no makeup on. I did my brows and my eyelashes and that was it because I have a pimple coming in. Good old mask knee. I didn't want to like make my skin any more irritated than it already is from wearing a mask for 13 hours a day. I figured I would just go makeup list because I wear a mask a day. Like you can't, it doesn't really matter. So going up to the gas station and then we gotta head to work. I gotta be there in like 25 minutes. So we gotta hurry on down the road. I feel like shaker bottle lids either don't go on all the way so that when you shake them, they don't actually, they like fly everywhere, like out of the bottle, or the lid goes on so hard that you can't get it off, like just now, so. Oh, oh, so good. It's so good when it's cold. If you guys drink ketones and you haven't put them like in the fridge for a second or two, or um, put ice in there, do it. I feel like having it cold makes such a difference. Wow, the sky is beautiful. It's like literally cotton candy color. Hopefully these will wake me up. I don't know why, but I do not feel good. I went to eat dinner and I warmed up some corn that I had left over, so nothing weird about that. And then I made just like a couple turkey roll-ups um, and ham. I like was gonna make chicken and then chicken didn't sound good and I feel like this deli meat like needed to be eaten or it was gonna go bad, which maybe it was already bad, I don't know. So I made like three of those, and as I was eating them, I was like, oh, like I don't feel good. I had a protein shake earlier. I don't know what it could be. I didn't have milk, I had cashew milk, so it isn't like, it's like dairy or something. I just don't feel good, so I didn't really eat, which kind of sucks because I don't wanna be starving, and I didn't really bring much food. I brought like literally just snack. I just feel sick to my stomach now, so I'm like, is it even worth forcing myself to eat something when I don't feel good? I don't think so, but then I'm worried at like 4 a.m. I'm gonna wish I had brought food. But I'm also trying to not eat. I'm trying to not eat too much throughout my shift because every time I end up nauseous and I was like researching about it and a lot of people were saying that if you eat throughout the night when you're normally sleeping that it just like throws off your circadian rhythm even more than it's already thrown off with you being awake and that if you can avoid eating for the most part it like tends to help you get back to a normal circadian rhythm cycle some people just like stay on night shift all the time like on their days off but I don't want to do that and I don't do that and I'm not going to so if I need to be somebody that's like pretty frequently flipping back to day schedule, I need to be able to eat during the day. So I don't really want to be eating at night because I get I get hungry, but then I eat something and I feel nauseous afterwards and I'm nauseous all the way until like I go home and go to bed and wake up again, then it's gone. But it takes a while and like I was just reading about people saying like when your body's forced to digest food when it's normally resting, just at that period of nighttime, it like just can totally throw things off. So this is my last week of orientation for level two, not overall. Um, so I don't have like critically ill sick babies right now. They just orient us to level two babies, which are like a little bit less complex. They're babies that they can have IVs, they can have drips and lines and stuff, but they can't have, um, they can't be like on CPAP or vented or anything like that. They can't be intubated. They, they're pretty stable is what I would say for the most part, relatively speaking. So I've been orienting to those types of babies for, this is my sixth week and this is my last week. So after these three shifts, I'll be by myself for level three babies or level two. And that's gonna be for a little bit until I go back to orientation for level three. But holy cow, I can't believe I'm about to be by myself. Like, I'm a real nurse, what the heck. Still, still don't buy it. Hey guys, so I just got to work and I'm just doing 
my survey um, that I have to do for COVID before I go into the hospital and I'm going to head in. So I will talk to you guys in like 12 hours when I get up or when I get out, not when I get up, when I get out. Okay. See you later. Bye. Hi guys. It is now 7.51 a.m. on Wednesday. It's so confusing to me that the day changes on night shift. I always lose track of what day it is because of that. Um, but I'm just on my way home. It was a good shift. It was freaking nuts. It was freaking nuts. It was a lot. I finished off like my nurse gave report for me. Like my nurse who's orienting me. She gave report for me and I just charted my ass off. <laughs> It's what it was. So that was last night. I am tired as heck. Um, I did survive without food. I had um, some fruit snacks at like midnight. I, I found a tiny, 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 like child size bag of fruit snacks. And I ate that. And I'm friggin' starving now. Probably because I hardly ate yesterday. But I'm really tired. So. I think I'm going to get a snack when I get home, which normally I just go straight to bed, but I'm really hungry. So I think it would probably help me fall asleep if I wasn't so hungry. Um, so I think I'm going to get a snack or something and eat and go to bed. Good morning. Good afternoon. Hello. It's about 3.15 and I am just on my way to... Oh, to the gym so I've been up for like an hour now I got home this morning I don't think I've did I vlog yeah I did vlog on the way home <laughs> okay I got home and I like immediately laid down I think I remember talking about potentially like eating something I had a cheese stick <laughs> not that that's much at all I just didn't want a lot and I didn't really know what to eat. So I had a cheese stick and I had some caffeine free ketones to try and like see if that would help kind of hold me over. So um, I had that when I got home and then I went to sleep. I was asleep by like 9 a.m. and slept until about two. So like five hours, which is actually really good for me. I typically like sleep from like nine to 12. It's terrible. So the fact that I slept till two was pretty great. And I just kind of laid around um, until like three o'clock. I answered some emails. I did some stuff on Instagram. I talked to, well, no, Connor went to sleep, but he had sent me messages while I was asleep. So I responded to him and then I just got ready and I drank, oh, sorry, the sun is like kind of killer. Um, I don't even know if you can see me, so apologize if you can't, but I drank some caffeinated ketones to try and like help me start to wake up and I'm on my way to the gym. I'm going to do like 45 minutes of, I'm hoping to get in an hour and a half is my goal, so 90 minutes, but we'll see. I'm going to do some low intensity cardio, so just walking on the treadmill, nothing crazy. Sorry about this lighting. I know it's going to be horrible when I edit this because I can see that like this part of my hair is in the sunlight, but whatever. Um, I'm gonna do some low intensity cardio, just walk, literally nothing crazy. I am so sore, so sore from the last few days. Like my legs hurt so bad. So I'm gonna try and just like do some walking and probably do some stretching or some yoga. And then I think afterwards I'm gonna try and run over to the grocery store. I'm almost out of coffee creamer, so I'm going to get coffee creamer, and then I think I might grab some lettuce and make like a big salad for dinner before I go to work tonight, and maybe a couple other things. We'll see. I don't really know, but um, I just have a bunch of random food in the fridge, nothing that really like totally goes together, so just trying to figure out like what I can eat and stuff, and I was going to eat before I came. But again, I had a bunch of random food and I just like didn't know before I came to the gym right now, but I didn't know what to eat. And yeah, so pulling up to the gym now, gonna get my workout in and then we will go to the grocery store and then it'll be time to go back to work. So happy, what's today? Wednesday. Okay guys, made it to work. It's 6.43, I gotta go. Okay, bye.